UFC lightweight Jalen the Tarantula Turner thrives on facing his fears. As a teenager, Jalen turned a crippling phobia of spiders into a passion for the eight-legged creatures. Jalen now applies that same mental approach to his octagon career and believes that's what makes him such a unique threat. We head to California to find out more in this edition of Fighter Focus. Jalen the Tarantula Overcoming fear makes you a better person and builds your confidence. Going in there and fighting, risking being embarrassed in front of hundreds of thousands of people, that's really scary in itself. But by the time you start walking out, there's no return. You got two choices. You can either face your fears and overcome something, or you can run away and hide and be scared and crumble under the pressure. And I'm not one to crumble. He's got a phenomenal physique for the sport, especially for this weight class, and real knockout power as well. Oh, that's it, that's it, that's it. Oh, and Potter's oh, down. Potter's down. He might be out, that's it. That is it. The Tarantula, wow. Jalen Turner. Uncomfortable situations definitely build a character. They, they sculpt who you become as a person. Fear of most things are projected from your experiences, from your parents, from your friends. I think I was about 16. I had friends, they didn't like spiders, they didn't like tarantulas. And like that energy kind of like projected onto me. You know, to realize that I became like a bit arachnophobic was kind of like, oh shoot, like there's something going on here. It was just something I knew I wasn't gonna want to live with and I wasn't gonna be comfortable with, so I was like, you know what? Let me like at least try, you know, let me try something out, let me try to get over this fear, let me let me overcome something. So to overcome it, I just went to a pet store, bought a pet tarantula. <laughs> it was it was pretty big. She was probably about like this big when I got her. Just instantly loved it. I was like, that's that's a cool pet. I did it, overcame it, I never looked back. She's an adult female. She try to eat your finger when you first put uh, anything in there or put your hand in there, but after you get out, she's pretty calm and cool. Taking care of tarantulas gives me like a, a sense of meaning. Just having a little creature that you can care for. It's cool to get the understanding of them and interact with them how other people wouldn't. I feel like spiders is just so misunderstood. Food, a little bit of a heat source, and Water is all they need to survive. If you get a good one, they're uh, usually pretty tame and handleable. You can tell when a tarantula is going to attack because they'll like raise their front legs at you. But as you can see, she's just prodding her legs around, just feeling around, thinking I'm a branch, not thinking I'm a threat at all. Getting my first tarantula and going into the gym were definitely similar feelings. So many times I was like, I didn't want to walk into that gym. I had a teammate that was really good that used to like whoop my ass. I wouldn't want to go. I'd like sit at the bus stop and like mentally prepare for an hour, hour and a half, two hours before I go walked into the gym. It broke me down, it built me back up, um, put me through everything, a lot of emotions. You figure out who you truly are through those situations. It made me grow, develop. I just had to get over it, had to overcome it. Fighting, I always felt like it would pay off. I think it's something that is within me. I don't like being afraid of things. I like to grow and adapt and figure myself out and be the best version of myself that I can. The nickname, the tarantula, that was like the first thing that popped into my head when I was trying to like figure out a nickname. You know, Anderson Silva was already a spider. He was my favorite fighter, you know? So I was like, well, the tarantula would be a cool spinoff. They started calling me that around the gym and it just stuck. Next to the scale, Jalen Turner. Nobody's weighed in with the live 
animal ever. Sometimes it's better to ask for forgiveness than permission, so I just did it. Official weight 163 and a half for Jalen Turner. You know, <laughs> it was pretty cool to do, but it was mainly like just making history. That's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> Being original, being an outlier, standing out from the crowd, you know, it was fun. People are very, very high on this young man. He's something special. He stays calm, cool, collected. It's almost like he knows that the finish is inevitable. If he keeps touching you, he knows he's going to get you out of there. Well, that's it. Jalen Turner forces a referee stoppage. Tarantulas, they're really patient, and they'll wait for minutes, weeks, months for a prey item to come across them, and they'll snatch it up. That's kind of similar to my style. I'm really patient and methodical when I'm in there. I wait for my prey to give me an opening, and I take it. Oh, look at that. I think he's got it. Wow. Do it. Huge submission win for the Tarantula here in Vegas. Imagine how dangerous he can become if his game continues to evolve. I feel like my mindset now is completely bulletproof. Nothing really bothers me. Nothing really gets to me. I love fighting. I love the feeling of winning. And I'm really stubborn. I got goals I want to achieve. I want to keep pushing towards them. And I don't really feel like there's anything that's going to hold me back from that. Not fear, not an opponent. Nothing's going to stop me.